How's it going? Alrighty. Happy Trucking Thursday. If you're watching this on a Thursday. And if you're not, well then happy trucking whatever day it is. Yeah, happy Trucking Thursday. What's the blade and story? It's two o'clock in the day, it's cracking day, just back in the yard. I have to drop my tank and lift an empty container and go to the park and get it off and get a full one on, so not too bad. Not too bad though at all. Look at this, look at this, see this container, look at this day of it. I know the reefer box had seen the better days. So it has. <laughs> She's a bit dented. But anyway, that's what we're at. Let's go and get it done. Who told me my mirrors were filthy? Look at the door to that. Enjoying the good weather too much. Now she's in there now. She's now locked in. And the mirror's a bit cleaner. Hurry! Right. Get around with the headboard. Only a 40 foot box. Only a 40 foot. That's it. sunroof and the hero still won't fly out. I'm going to the garage here now for a minute. And then we'll hit them all away. There's not really no parking here in this place lately. Side motors here, look as are flat out.
see you in the part. Good luck now. People get very confused here at this junction with cars. They're in and they're out and they're like, oh, maybe I'll wait till the last minute when I go in. Two cars here ahead of us in the middle line. What's the best? Are they going to go for the tunnel or go for the city? Oh, there's the first one with bright lights on. Huh? Oh, the second one's gone in. Is the other one going to go, is he? Is he going? No, oh, he's going for the tunnel. One out of two, there you go. trucks if you happen to have a tag. He's going through there now, where are Sometimes the cars get stuck there for ages and they get out and they go over and they pay and they're fluting around and all sorts of them. That's the fire brigade that were ahead of us there as well. I heard they go through a regular. They go through just for a, a patrol, you know, or just for a, a novelty, I suppose. Whatever they be at. Now, the place I'm going is over there behind that hedge. It's called Reefer Care. Coming in in the oil now. There's a bit of a twist and a turn to get to it nowadays. But always was a little bit. factory on the right hand side where they made the flower for years and years it's all closed down now I'm not sure what they're doing with that Adams factory they're doing something with it I think it's gonna be like a bit of a touristy thing and I don't know if it's a preserved building or not now but I don't think it's getting knocked down in any truck is to the left here and uh, P and O is down the other end now where C truck used to be or well, P and O is gone now that's the new entrance to uh, <coughs> C truck on the left you go up and over that red that red bridge that we came under there a minute ago truck is, is a place called tank wash. You get tanks washed out. Uh, chemical tanks and all that sort of stuff, you know. That's a nice staff JP Ryan has.
see them all. There you go. This next place you'll be in the right hand lane there, but we'll go down the left hand lane. There's no queue, and there's less speed ramps in the left hand lane. Just look at it down the bottom here, you know. On the left hand side is what they call the J stack for this same place. Watch your speed around the port, they'll be out after you. They might be out as hairs are checking your speed limit. Go in with a, an empty chassis, you can use the right hand line here, and uh, normally it's a bit quicker for the queue. Is but um, Anybody asked you weren't in here? All right, just you were just sitting there in the dashboard, okay? This is where they check the containers and seals and those cameras and whatever else they have to do. Sorry, you weren't in here, you didn't see any of this. No, 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 we weren't in here at all. Then. And your ticket has the, the letter and the number, so hang on to G, which is on the right here, and let number 40. That's how you know where your, uh, your container is. And most trucks have the registration number written on the roof, now we have mine on the roof as well. The sticker on the roof, so the crane man definitely knows it's you. Here's 40 here, 40 in the middle of the of the container spot. Just get yourself half lined up and wait for the crane to come. Just where I park and you might see, I know it's coming in there, one of the um, cranes, one of these yokes here, getting worked on, but it's still on the other end of the yard, which is very unusual. Must be a big job getting done with it. Not only you park them there, they can do what they gotta do out of the way, you know. This one is down further. Set down area. Yes, 
see the big crane down the left hand side there? And there's two of them there, and then the container one in the middle, they're working away in the cab there. Just be getting a bit, of, a bit more than just the service. Anyway. Back to the yard and see if there's anything else to do. If not, I think I'm doing this in the morning. This container, I think I'm dropping it down and then I'm doing a tip and tank tomorrow. I think. Um, where are you going tomorrow on the tip and tank? If I am doing it, I've been there before and I think I have it recorded and it's just not out yet. But it's there somewhere on a memory card, so we'll see. I'm gonna put the two of them together, you know. We'll see. Anyway. You weren't in here if anybody asked, sorry. Yeah, you weren't in here. Thanks for watching and all that, yeah. Like, some subscribes and all that sort of stuff, yeah. Jesus. There's the shoulder going.